How are you all doing? The Weirdo Ball here. Now in this video, I'm just going to show you a few tips and tricks that I use to um, defeat these sort of scary looking enemies that you come across that are usually a lot higher level than you and um, you kind of feel like you want to defeat them because they might have some really good loot, which usually they actually do. So it's quite a good idea to sort of give it a go. Um, as you can see, this guy's level 31 and he's a pretty badass looking dude. He's actually one of the um, men of the Wild Hunt. Or, I can't remember what they're called. I think there's just the wild hunt. He's a wild hunt dude. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyway, he's a pretty cool looking dude and I thought, well, do you know what, I'm going to give it a go. So I started started off, as you could see, uh, pretty poorly by throwing some bombs at him, which did absolutely nothing to him really. <laughs> so I thought, right, this is going to have to be a good old fashioned sword fight, uh, which ended up being a really fun sword fight actually. It's quite rare in this game that you get such a long battle, because when you're the right level, um, usually enemies aren't actually that strong. So it's quite nice to come up against something that's actually pretty hard to kill. <laughs> right, well, let's get into it. So first of all, what you want to do is equip your uh, shield power, which Geralt has, which is really cool. I've said this before in videos, but yeah, it's literally one of his best powers, I think. Especially when you come up against an enemy whose attack can basically kill you in one hit. Like, you'll see he has quite a long sword, so his range is pretty long as well. So if he gets you with that swiping attack that he does, it's pretty much game over in one blow. Um, so you've got to be really careful. Basically what you need to do is equip the shields, go in for an attack. Usually only just do one attack. You can see I'm very rep, like wary and I'll back off. So I'm using circle at this point. So I'm going to hit circle at this point as well because he hits you. He kind of staggers you and you'll get that with higher level enemies than you. They'll stagger you quite often. So you need to, to get out of that stagger, you just need to repeat repeatedly tap on circle so you get out of it but basically equip your shield go in for the attack hit circle to dodge back then go in again attack hit circle dodge back and you kind of get into a routine which I did here which basically he kept missing me with his attack which is what you want because you get into the I just lost the rhythm there which is kind of annoying um, I had to uh, quickly repair my sword because this guy is no joke <laughs> he take my sword is taking a beating on this one um, so yeah you just keep doing this eventually just sort of dodge, so go close to him, then circle now, he'll attack, and just go in for your attack. Never try and attack a higher level uh, character, sort of enemy, never attack them when your shield is down, because 9 times out of 10 you'll cock it up and they'll hit you and you'll die, and you'll be really annoyed, because it takes so long to take their health down. As you can see, I've had to speed this up quite a bit. So um, yeah, just take your time, just dodge, equip your shield, and attack him and every time he takes off your shield take a step back like wait for your uh, mana stuff to charge up put it back on and then go in for another attack this is an example of how you don't fight an enemy that's a higher level than you <laughs> uh, you can you're gonna see in a minute that basically yeah one hit and you go down I was a bit careless because I tried to go in for too many too many hits, he took off my shield, I should have backed off, but yeah, and he finished me off. <laughs> but anyway, this is kind of similar, um, I tried the bombs again on this dude, but they don't really seem to do much on really high level ranking enemies, so <laughs> gotta go in for the sword attacks. In a way, this guy's actually a lot easier than the last guy I fought, because he's a hell of a lot slower, and you can almost predict his attacks, uh, whereas the other guy was, because he was more sort of, sort of human shaped, uh, he's a lot faster and it was harder to go in for the attacks, whereas this guy, he kind of has his, that attack, <laughs> then his sort of big ground smash attack, and then he'll just have his swipe attack, so he's only really got three, which are all very slow, and you can kind of dodge them very, very easily, so again, it's just equip your shield, attack, dodge, that was to get out of the way of his, um, his sort of ground smash, which has a really big radius. Um, so yeah, use X in that at that point. But usually, just use circle again, back off, go in, hit, but never do two hits. <laughs> um, you can use the triangle, which is the heavy attack, obviously. But I like to use square because I mean it may take a bit more time, but you're almost guaranteed that you'll be safe. Uh, so yeah, equip the shield, square, circle again uh, to back off, and then go in. If he gets you, obviously, just back off away, equip your shield. 
and uh, go for another hit. So hopefully you can use these tips and uh, next time you come up against an enemy that's a little higher rank than you, you won't be sort of put off and you'll um, persevere and eventually you'll get some good loot. But anyway, thanks for watching guys. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later.